Hi, I'm Alicia. Thanks for watching this video. Today we're going to build a kinetic sculpture. Let's take a quick look at what you'll need. See the link to the CAD file in the description. You can cut all the pieces you'll need for this project using the file. After you cut all the pieces for the project, you should ensure that all your parts are clean using the grinder. Let's take our long piece of quarter inch round bar and file a point using the sand belt. We sanded it down first because it's easier to work with when it's longer. Now clamping it in the vise, we cut off the top inch and a half. I'm using an auto roller to curve the bar. If you don't have access to a roller, you can even hand bend it. Next, we're going to weld the curved bar to the bottom of the boat. Space it like this. You can bend the 1 8 round bar by hand into the shape of a fishing line. Now we're going to tack weld the fishing line to the fisherman's hand. Now we're going to weld the jumping fish to the fishing line. Next we're going to add fish to the bottom of the curved round bar. Position your fish to the center of the bar to ensure your piece is balanced. Find the center of gravity by balancing the piece on your finger. Weld the pivot point to the center of gravity you have found. If you found your sculpture isn't balanced the way you like, hand bend the round bar to find the perfect center of gravity. Next, I'm going to be welding the 3 8 round bar to the base. I've used a scrap piece of metal for the base. To make the cradle, weld both pieces of angle iron. I'm tacking the cradle to the 3 8 round bar on the base. This is your piece of art, and by hand bending the round bar, you can decide your perfect balance. Thanks for watching. We can't wait to see your projects.